I got a question. Do you think Carmelo should have went with Miami? Do he? Now, to answer your question, I'm going to say yes. And the only reason why I'm saying yes is because I'm basing it off of what happened in New York. The New York Knicks organization only had really two good years of really building around Carmelo and Anthony. And after that, Carmelo and Anthony was really just wasting the rest of his prime years in New York. I feel like if Carmelo and Anthony teams up with Brian and D. Wade, he at least wins two championships with them. At least two. Because one of the things, and I'm not even the biggest Melo fan, but I just know that Melo really did, like, after anything after 2013 with the New York Knicks, literally they just gave up. They wasn't even trying to build around Carmelo and Anthony no more. Then Phil Jackson came over there and just stunk everything up. Because I'm saying all this because the organization really had two good years when they had a solid team. And that was 2012 and 2013. Once they let go of J.R. Smith, Iman Shumpert, Tyson Chandler, and Jason Kidd retired, once all that team went out and then they let go of Lynn Sanity, which really messed up everything, they wasn't trying to compete to win no more. And Carmelo Anthony was just wasting his prime over there. If Carmelo Anthony is over here in Miami, oh, he's winning championships. There's no doubt about it. And there's no way Carmelo Anthony would be a third option. I, I'm sorry, third or fourth option is just not happening. I really do see that Carmelo Anthony will probably be sharing the second option with Dwayne Wade. But y'all let me know what y'all think.